Now this is one of the most popular questions I've been getting about DistroKid. Why did DistroKid put my song on YouTube and create a topic channel for my artist? I have to stress this, that when you actually upload music to DistroKid, there is actually a checkbox at the end saying, hey, we're gonna put this on YouTube. Don't come after us saying, hey, why is my music on YouTube? And what's ironic is I've had so many comments on my DistroKid videos saying, hey, Mark, I'm really confused. I uploaded this song at DistroKid and they put it on YouTube. They made a topic channel. I didn't want them to do that. Now, one, you did check that checkbox. I just have to be honest. I mean, yes, I know that feeling of, let's say with the iTunes terms and conditions, you just hit agree and you don't think about it, but it is there and there's only like a couple check boxes that you do have to check. So I do suggest reading those, just wanna be honest. The second thing is that any single time you upload music and Google Play is selected as a store or as a service that DistroKid uploads to, it automatically puts it on YouTube. Google Play and YouTube are kind of in the same category. Now, if you're in the position where you're like, look, I don't want my song to be put on YouTube. I don't want my artist to have a YouTube topic channel. You could uncheck that. But remember, not only are your songs not going on YouTube and the YouTube topic channel, but they're also not going to go on Google Play. So keep that in mind. DistroKid automatically has all their stores and services auto-checked when you go to upload a song. So let's say if you're really against that, you can uncheck Google Play and YouTube. A second thing I really want to say too, is that even though DistroKid did put your song on YouTube and YouTube made a video about the song and it's on the topic channel, you can still upload that same song on your own YouTube channel. And I suggest you do that. That's what I do, especially when it comes to SEO and getting your songs discovered. I can do way more SEO wise because I can type everything in manually. I have a better description, all this kind of stuff than I do if like say it just automatically gets put on a topic channel. I have an entire video listed below in the description of seven ways to get more views and more streams on your music via YouTube. YouTube is a powerhouse of a platform. And being honest, especially for me being both a YouTuber and a musician, I get so much traffic from my YouTube videos, not just about the videos that I make, like videos like this that are educational videos or vlogs, but all my actual music as well, put as a video on YouTube.